Albert Goldthorpe is quite simply a rugby league legend. And as a mark of respect for his outstanding achievements, the League Express decided to name their own prestigious award in his honour. Well, it's been going since 2008, and the Albert Goldthorpe medal is intended to be given to the player who's the best and fairest throughout the season. We give points for every Super League match from round one to round 27. Uh, it's a 3-2-1 format so that the uh, best player gets three points and so on. Um, so we, um, we, we obviously then publicise the Albert Goldthorpe table in League Express uh, every week. Some great players have won it. Actually, Danny Bruff won the inaugural uh, Albert Goldthorpe medal in 2008. That was followed by Michael Dobson of Hulkington Rovers in 2009. It's a real privilege for me to pick up this award. It's probably one of the highlights of my career so far in picking up awards. And last year we had joint winners um, who were Sam Tompkins and Pat Richards of Wigan. Uh, got us a fortune, incidentally, because we had to have two gold medals prepared. <laughs> I'm still recovering from that. Just to come and see the past players, you know, I've been sitting next to Alex Murphy from Medina, and that was a that was a good time. And um, you know, it's, it's it's good to meet all the uh, past players and you know present players, people like Danny Medeiros, James Jones, if you can, you know. Double all here. And I'd just like to call up the winner of this year's Albert Girl Medal. And this year it's Rangi Chase, who's actually it's been a fantastic uh, battle for the Albert Girl Medal this year. Um, there have been you know, several players who were contenders, but in the end, Rangi Chase and Sam Tompkins just ran away from the field a little and it went down to the very last week. I was saying during the year, oh, I don't care if I get it, but then when it got to the end, I was like, oh. After the game, I said to my girlfriend, oh, I don't think I would have got it because I um, had a bad game and I always knew that Sam <laughs> you know, always plays well. So, and then I got told yesterday that I, um, that I won it and I couldn't believe it really. So, I don't know, it was a bit of a surprise. Thank you very much indeed. I think the Rookie of the Year award this year, uh, without doubt, has been one of the, the most hotly contested awards. I'd like to ask him to come to receive the uh, Albert Goldthorpe Rookie of the Year medal. And of course it's Mr Sam Tompkins of Wigan Morris. Well, this year is the Rookie of the Year uh, and really welcome a member of the nice squad, Jermaine McGilvery. It's a huge honour for me, you know, I've worked really hard to get where I am now. A lot of people have like put time in me and my family have put, put a lot of effort in me and for me to win that award is just it's a good reward for me. Sports are about a lot more than Super League, but today is about presenting a trophy to, to a team that has built steadily, uh, caught, drawn, from being an also-run team to a very consistent team. Very proud of the, uh, the award today. And probably represents the fact that we've played well together. I'd like to ask you, a representative of Warrington to step forward and receive the Albert Goldthorpe Award for the best team. <laughs> it's an incredible honour uh, to be here and uh, picking up this award on behalf of the players. I've got a great bunch of boys. Lifetime award, lifetime service to the game. There is no, there is no better man. I think it's very, very nice. Uh, I, I didn't even know. I mean. Uh, the buggers never told me, and uh, I, I just thought I was coming as normal for a uh, free drink and a good meal, which you always get. The cat's out of the bag. The recipient today of this, and I'm very pleased to give it to her, is my old friend, Ray French. <laughs> Harry said uh, I had the gift of the gab. I do admit to that in the past, but uh, I'm absolutely gobsmacked uh, here over this uh, today. I must confess I wondered why Martin had invited me. There is no imitation. There is no copy. And 50% do love it, and 50% do throw things at the television. And we know that I'm referring to my great friend, Mike Stevenson here. By the way, Ray, thank you for saying that 50% of the people that watch TV actually like me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think it's more on 90% <laughs> that throw things at the TV.
Would you like to come forward, Robert? You know, a wonderful award. Um, as a, as, a, as a rugby league player, you just end up thinking about the professional aspect of the sport. And, you know, you turn out day in, day out, and you're doing your job. And a lot of the time, you don't really think about how many lives you're affecting. Those that know me, once I get a microphone in my hand, you should get very comfortable. I'm going to be here about half an hour. No, uh, what, a, what an amazing... I'd just like to thank the League Express for, you know, recognising my effort and, and, and my work.